Hello, dear colleagues. My name is Alexander. I'm a doctor and also leading expert and a member of company Technodent. I help medical practitioners to choose the best possible materials for daily medication. In this video, I would like to talk about epoxidin, the sealer based on epoxy resin. Top result in using of our materials uh, is highly appreciated by the dentists not only from Russia but also from CIS countries, West and East Europe, Middle Eastern countries, Southeast Asia and Latin America. Epoxidin issued in form of paste paste 4 ml plus 4 ml in plastic tubes. This material is intended for a sealing of the root canals using good aperture as well as silver and titanium posts. Material contains epoxy resin, amine hardening agents, filling materials, plasticizing material and zirconium oxide as a radiopaque filler. The mixing of white and yellow paste in equal proportions result in plastic mixture with the lay flat white of 5-10 microns which is easily inserted on good aperture points and seals the tooth root canals well. At room temperature, it doesn't lose its plasticity during 4 hours. The product hardens during 24 hours in the root canal with forming of bio-inert amino resin with a good adhesion and slight solubility. The overfilling of the material outside the apex doesn't result in complications, but it can bring some discomfort in the treated tooth. Storing the material at temperature conditions below 20 degrees in Celsius can cause densification of the white paste due to increase of epoxy resin viscosity. It is recommended to hold the white paste at temperature range 25-30 degrees in Celsius during 2 hours. For receiving mixture, the white and yellow paste are styled with a dry clean pellet knife on the glass plate in a proportion one by one till homogeneous thin and thickness. You should inject this paste in a small portions into the sterile and dried canal with the help of the root needle or root canal sealing instrument at the low speed of the rotation during insertion and withdrawal out of the canal for avoiding air inclusions and formation of the pores in the material. Using good aperture points the product should be injected in a small portion and firmed up with the points greased with the paste. For condensation and aspiration technique, with the use of warm good aperture, it is recommended to use a little amount of material to cover the walls of the canal. Please do not overfill the canal with the paste in order to avoid pushing the product out of the apex. In a case of insertion of the product into the interior dental canal, it should be removed out of it. If it is necessary to remove the sealer and a good aperture, it is recommended to use thermomechanical treatment. After sealing, the canal should be provided isolation and restoration of the tooth crown. Some dentists prefer to use the ready form in a double syringe for ease of application. Personally, I know that in the tip mixer sometimes remains more material that is needed for the sealing of this canal, so the issue form in a syringe often leads to overspending of material in two or more times. And here we must decide for ourselves do we want to spend twice more material for the economy of a 40 or 50 seconds or we can go in more economically reasonable way? The many of currently existing materials based on the epoxy resin can cause post-filling pains. The occurrence of this effect is mostly connected with the fact that in the paste hardener as a one of the components added eurotropine or its compounds. Eurotropine under the influence of temperature above 20-30 degrees on Celsius starts to decompose into ammonia vapors and formaldehyde. Ammonia itself 
is a toxic compound and formaldehyde vaporous can cause the mummification of surrounding tissues. Furthermore, evaporation in the sealed root canal leads to the increase of the pressure and consequently to post-treatment pains. An epoxidin of a technodent production initially was changed and modified the hardening mechanism in the way that material doesn't cause vaporization even at a temperature of 120 degrees on Celsius, which is, by the way, very important when working with a warm gutta percha. That is why epoxidin doesn't increase the pressure in the root canal system, which ensures the absence of pain in the patient after treatment. There is a perception, the more expensive material is the better one, and I fundamentally disagree with that. The price of the final product, regardless of its quality, can be different. Company Technodem carefully selects raw materials and provides multi-stage control of its quality. All the production is carried out on the modern high-quality equipment according to our developed sites. All the technology of production, packaging and storing smoothly running to the perfect conditions providing absence of economic losses. We do not make extra charges placing on the market the high quality dental materials that meet all international requirements for a fair price. Personally, I would like to recommend you for the daily administration the cost-effective materials from trusted manufacturer with the most convenient form of issuance. Finally, I would like to say, do not forget to talk with the dentist on which opinion do you trust. For sure, they have tested the different materials and with pleasure share with you their observations. I wish you pleasant work and smiley patience. Sincerely yours, Alexander.